What's up guys, it's John Reeves Live, and today we're going to be checking out a completely new group to this channel. This is the first time I've ever seen or heard anything of them, but a lot of people have been suggesting them for quite a while now. So if y'all are new to this channel, please smash that sub button, and uh, yeah, this is actually Nightwish Ghost Love Score, so this is actually like kind of an older video. I'm excited to see this. I love checking out bands live, so it kind of cuts out the middleman if we watch this live first. I'm a huge fan of doing that. Let's get into the reaction right freaking now. Three, two, one, BOOM! Oh, dang. I love how full that drum set sounds. Yes. Look at the crowd too, yes. Oh, this is a cool setup, dude. Very cool setup. <laughs> it's just a vibe, isn't it? Dang. Yes! I had no idea what to expect, but I wasn't really expecting this. That dude's getting his shirt completely taken off. What? What? Listen, I'm going to back it up a little bit so I don't step on her toes here, but I was not expecting this in the freaking least bit. She's got like an operatic voice. I was thinking we were going to get like, I don't know, some like arch enemy type stuff where she's doing like metal growls or something. This is freaking good. She's got a great voice. Holy crap. The vibrato? <laughs> Just chilling, walking around. She has so much range. That is freaking crazy. That's almost a whistle right there at the end. And her vibrato, I've said this numerous times on my channel. I'm not a really big fan of like overdoing vibrato. She really has a good way of like putting it at the end of the note. She's using it in a perfect way. She's got great tone, man. God. You can tell their drummer's good, dude. Yeah. <laughs> 
Solo action, yes. LTD, beautiful guitar. It's a story, huh? This is like a full-on story we're getting right now. This is pretty beautiful. I love huge festivals like this. They're so fun. Yeah, dude. Grit in her voice right there was freaking beautiful. God, that was great, dude. It's hard for me. Like, this style of music normally, in my opinion, always is accompanied with, like, a very, very, very aggressive vocal. So, like, her voice here, in my ears at least, is, like, um, not necessarily conflicting, but it's conflicting from what I normally thought would work there. It's working perfectly. It's just not what I'm used to, I guess, if that's how I should say it. But the grit that she's got in her voice shows me that she can do that. She's just choosing not to. Just like the vibrato, just like these really high notes, she knows when to use it. And I think that that is very telling of a good vocalist if you know when to do these things just like the guitarist he's doing a guitar solo he obviously can do it he just doesn't overdo it the drummer he obviously can do these huge fills he knows when to so like clearly they're all great musicians and they know how to and when to use their instruments the way they do I think that's the same dude from the board. He's just lost his shirt now. Drum. 
<laughs> that is so cool. Tell me they ended their show with that song, right? Please, that was freaking insane. Like, I would not have the energy to do anything after that song. Holy crap, like, that's my first dip into Nightwish, and honestly, not anything like I was expecting it to be. Maybe the music a little bit, but her voice, not at all. Like, I literally came into this completely blind with a band name and somebody sent me over the link. That was really cool, that was unique, very different than I thought. And I guess, like, thinking about it now, after seeing that, it works so perfectly. It's one of those no duds type things where like a lot of the times with music like that like in the metal style of music if you are doing screaming it's kind of like to stand above that mix you've got to get like you've got to push harder to kind of get above where the guitar the drum the bass all those things are going already anyways and like her voice there cuts above the mix i think that that's something that's different about their band that not like you couldn't just fall into it i think a lot of the times people can like fudge that they're a good metal screamer when really in reality they're like blowing their vocal cords out and stuff like that there's no way that without talent training and knowing exactly what you're doing with your voice that she'd be able to sing an entire concert like that hitting those notes doing all the stuff that i just heard her do without knowing those things so you can't fake that and i think that's one of those things that like talent is timeless i've all i've said that a lot there's like fads and stuff like that that will come and go in music but i think talent itself is timeless i don't think talent is ever something that's going to be like um it's going to be like trending or something like that but it is something that's timeless meaning that song was good then and it's good now and it's impressive now almost 10 years later freaking awesome yeah first dip into nightwish and i actually really enjoyed that so if you guys have suggestions for other songs maybe music videos or something like that for me to check out of theirs please drop them in the comments again if y'all are new to the channel please smash that sub button spread some positivity out there be kind to one another and if anybody needs anything at all all of my socials are at john reeves live and i will catch you next time freaking toodles <laughs>